right, guys, a very quick rundown of how I'm adjusting a little Squatober. Woo! And that playlist. Get your playlist right, kids. Okay. I don't have the time. People say, oh, find the time. Don't worry about that. I'm making time. So here's how I work today. We squat. We come over here to the CMBs. That's where I'm working my overhead stuff, as well as the thick dumbbells. I'll show you the thick handles. So I work it as a circuit. Then <clears throat> I'm here. I've got my mace club. It's adjustable. Check out my buddy Frank DeMayo at Mace Fit. He'll hook you up with them. And then we got sleds down here. And so that is my circuit. Close grip bench will have to happen on another day. And also working in rotator cuff as well as upper back with face pulls. So I'm hitting this as a five round circuit and uh, then I got to hit the road. Then it's coaching, you know, 100 plus to 200 athletes. Then zip from work to the underground and then who knows what I got with the kids. A lot of run around, but I find a way to make it work. So a little squat tober adjustment as a circuit and do what you got to do to find a way to make adjustments, but to make sure you're training. We call that training for life. Boom. A thick dumbbell. Ah. Just getting in that work. It ain't perfect, but neither is life. And when the zombies attack, there will be no perfection. Woo! So got to train the mind as well as the body. Bang, go to ZachStrength.com. Uncensored newsletter.
So regular clean and press with a CMB. Then I grab the lip of it, more grip work, hand strength, because when the zombies come to attack, whew, your hands are gonna have to be strong. You have to punch right through their skull. Ah.